speed limit. Uh, if you're working with like Buffalo, you, when you have, I assume you have people there who own the Buffalo who are on the set when you're working right. and supervising. If the Buffalo runs off the cliff during the shoot, is it is the production liable to reimburse them or is it? They would, they, that, that would have to, it would depend on the circumstance, Brendan. I have no idea. You know, I would not be shooting with Buffalo anywhere near a cliff because I know better. But that's, see, that's what you bring to the party. By the way, what do you bring to the party? You want this job, right? You go in there to, and you see that production manager. Let's say your crew or your production, but you're just learning, right? You want to break in. You've got to think of a way that you come off the page. What do you bring to the party? They'll separate you from the other six guys that want it, and he hires you. Okay? Some of it's just personality. You can't change that. Just be who you are. In fact, never be who you're not. That'll ring so true as untrue. Okay? But one of the things that UPM brings to, his, to the party is his phone book. Who he knows. Right? Not the people who can get him jobs, the people in the industry who, in other words, he has access to these people. So he knows a Buffalo guy, right? He knows a Buffalo guy that works near Cliffs. <laughs> he knows people. He knows the insurance agent to call for the Buffalo. News. Whatever. I hope I wouldn't want that guy. That's too, that, that's too IT. <laughs> You're showing your stripes there, Roger. Uh, but. It's your phone book. It's who you know. Uh, the the best line I ever got was from the transportation coordinator who wanted, who went on Ray Hartwick, who's still alive, and I must be in his 80s, and he was the he was the transportation captain, which is the head of transportation on the Stepford Wives in 1974, and he said this line to me once, and he went on to become a production manager and then a producer and did big movies like Annie, you know, with John Huston. Um, not a great movie, but it was a big job. And he also did Mission Impossible, the first one, in England. So he had an excellent career. And he said something when he was a transportation captain, which was, you know, kid, now he never could say that well. You know, kid, he, he just wasn't Bogart, right? But he, he knew he wasn't Bogart, so he would talk that way. He said, you know, kid, all your life you've probably been told it's who you know, right? It's who you know, it's who you know. It's not. It's who you know to call. He was saying two things there, right? He was telling you you needed to get information and that you had the wherewithal to get that person who did know to take your call to get the information. It's who you know to call, and I think it's a great line. I wish I could take credit for it. <laughs>